let's see how much charcoal we can make in this three foot long, two foot wide, two foot deep cone pit. As you can see, we got a bunch of brush here I'm trying to burn. And we got a bunch back here too that uh, fallen branches from the wind here the last few days. So we're gonna make some biochar here in this little pit I dug. Uh, all the soil that I pulled out of this hole didn't go to waste. I used it over here, the topsoil to cap that hugel mound right there. But I also used a few of the shovelfuls of the not so good dirt to hill up my potatoes that are right here close by. We call this the Sean Dabrowski method. <laughs> I'm getting this started with mostly pine, but there will be a good mix of hardwoods and softwoods in here. So I've been feeding this little hole here for about 30 45 minutes and it can make quite a bit of charcoal so this represents sorry my neighbor is mowing so this represents about an hour of burning a mix of softwood and hardwood it's covered in about 85 to 90 percent ash on the top so I'm gonna go ahead and quench it here in a few minutes I brought over a couple of buckets of water and one bucket of compost tea just to start charging it as we put it out. finished product probably about 15 20 gallons of charcoal pretty happy with that anything like this here that didn't get burnt up will go to the bottom of the next pile and get reburnt <laughs> 